He's smart and articulate, an outspoken critic of the war in Ukraine, and in the eyes of the authorities, an enemy of the state. Vladimir Karamurza was arrested on charges of treason and spreading disinformation. But the 41-year-old knew no mercy would be offered here at his sentencing. His lawyer looked sad, but her client seemed bemused as the judge said he'd spend 25 years in prison. A sentence of unprecedented severity given to a man for speaking his own mind. This is not Russia's war. This is yet another military adventure by the unaccountable, unelected, authoritarian and, frankly, increasingly deranged dictator in the Kremlin by the name of Vladimir Putin. Here, Kara Merzer speaks to Sky News just after Russia launched its invasion. A committed Democrat, he was prepared to criticize the regime at a time when tens of thousands of Russians had decided to flee. But the activist, who also holds British nationality, was aware of the possible consequences. I think the best thing this regime would like for us to do is to give up and run away. And we're not going to give them that pleasure. We met him in 2016 as he entered a slate of candidates in that year's parliamentary election. It wasn't easy. At a party event, we saw the security services sneaking aboard the boat used for the campaign launch. The following year, he was poisoned for the second time and almost lost his life. He blames the security service. I'm really worried about his health because he survived after two attempts of poisoning and uh, his health is weak and this prison will kill him. Outside court, Kara Merzer's lawyer said his spirit remains undiminished. When he heard the sentence, 25 years, he said, I realised I was doing everything right. The UK's ambassador said she was shocked by the sentence. And she called for his immediate release. Basic human rights have evaporated in Putin's Russia. There is no room now to challenge the man in charge. John Sparks, Sky News.